Alright, so now we're going to be lettering a monument. Um, just showing you how you can work the text tools. So, first thing you want to do. Alright, let's let's go ahead and put a um put a name up here. Um, what you can do a few ways to do this, but you want to center it. Just draw a line real quick. That's the center. So now if you take your text. Alright. And let's see. Up here is where you can have it left justify, right justify. I have it centered. Let's go ahead and make this a little bigger. This is where you can change your font height. So let's do 2.5 for now. And then bring it down. That'll work, I guess. Uh, let's change it to modified Roman. Yeah. Alright, so let's say there's another way. You can center this. That's pretty easy. So like, here we go. What you want to do is you want to click on it, hold down Shift, and click on with whatever you want to center it with. So Unfortunately, because this is selected, it's not going to center it quite quite right, height wise. So you have to manually do that. Anyways, all right. So let's go ahead and add uh some text over here just add a simple name change it to one and a quarter 1.25 Okay. Just hit enter. Put in the date, which is um gonna be a one inch. Let's just do January. All right. Now let's um. Actually, let's just keep it like that. Let's get the spacing right. We want a half inch space. So you want to take if it's an inch lettering, you'll adjust your spacing here. If you want a half inch, you just add 0.5 to one. So you'll have a 1.5, and that'll give you a half inch space. Move it down. Again, we know it's centered because I have my guideline here, and the center of this is running right through it. All right, so all right, let's say you you had a death date, and you want to line this up right here. All right, so let's measure this. Let's say this is on the um. This is on the stone, so you're at the stone right now, measuring it. It's like eight point 
it's on about eight inches. Eight, just just over eight. So eight will be fine. But uh, all right, we know it's modified Roman. All right, so here's what you want to. Let's put in um let's just put in December twenty second thousand twelve. All right. So if you look down here you see the length is eight point three and you need it um a little bit closer to eight. So what you want to do, you can do several things. If you highlight it, you can do a fixed length. You can highlight it and click on character spacing. And then you can adjust it down to about eight. wherever you want it. That's about good. Again, that was up here. If you highlight it, it's up here at character spacing. Click on that and you can adjust it to whatever. And it adjusts all the spaces between all the characters the same. So let's go back to eight. That's good. One other thing you can do is you can click between, and if you do shift, comma, it'll decrease the space. If you do shift period, it'll increase the space. like that we'll keep it right there though because we know that's the size we need and you can put it on the rock when you get there You going home? No, I gotta go to US. Oh, okay. Alright, so you All right. So that's pretty much lettering right there. Um, let me think if there's anything else. Well, okay, so you wanna edit some text. Let's go ahead and zoom on. Spacebar will zoom in on uh, whatever, whatever you have. It'll fit the screen. All right. Let's say you want to edit some of this text. Uh, I mean, like the twos you want a little straighter or something. What you can do is go to text. Remove text smart at normal text. Now, if you hit F5, is ungroup, or you can right click, group, ungroup. Now you can select each one individually. Let's make, let's make this two. Let's make this D not have any, any of these on the end. You can add points. These are your tools for editing this kind of stuff. Let's zoom in on it. All right. You can delete points, really, to do that. But um, 
so I just move that with this hook tool and now you can take the eraser to delete a couple points and that'll straighten it up take that hook you can use your guides if you need to to, to get it perfect but um you know if you weed that out it's gonna look fine of course you probably wouldn't want to do that but if you want to, you can do the same thing over here to straighten it just straighten something like this up just like that. Well, let's, let's delete that. This middle point. There you go. That looks better. <coughs> Hopefully you understand that now. I think that's about all there is to texting if you want have any questions you can comment or of course call us I guess I'll show you one more thing this is not that important really but I'll take this rectangle So you have something like this, and you want your text to go along with that. Let's create a new text though, because that's no longer at. All right. If you want it to go along with that. you can um, hold down shift you can select both fit text shapes to path and then you can adjust exactly where you want it 